All right, guys, so we have a bunch of pretty insane information here today for Call of Duty World War II Zombies. A bunch of storyline stuff here we need to dig into, a bunch of different teasers, an actual image of what is basically the new zombies map location or at least i'm pretty sure it is I'm, everyone is pretty set on that there are a bunch of different things we need to go through here um and obviously the reveal is like a week or so we'll probably know a lot more we'll again see a gameplay trailer we're really gonna start seeing a lot of cool information as the days progress until next week at comic con when we see that huge reveal so this video again very interesting a lot of cool stuff so definitely if you can leave a like that'd be greatly appreciated and let's get started so a lot of this is from mr waffle waffles he got a you know care package from sledgehammer games and it had some zombies teasers there's a separate website and i'll leave all you know there's a bunch of links on reddit and they give you links there um there's different websites to type in these codes and then you get these different teasers and they're different codes i'm pretty sure the past couple images from like earlier today were for campaign and then he got this new code um it's obviously for this girl mary's journal and then you have a you know image and a, a letter and just all this insane stuff here so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna read these letters and while i do that i'll probably put the image up on screen just so you guys can like look at the image and sort of you know get an idea of what is going on potentially here so i'm gonna do that and then after we go through the letters and stuff and after we we look at the storyline information you know we'll straight up just talk about the image and we'll talk about the setting and we'll talk about what exactly we're going to be seeing for you know this map and this is probably the first actual image we're seeing of it in some form or another um this is definitely the location maybe it's not the exact map but it's definitely the location and maybe from these letters it'll give us obviously more information on the location the map what it's going to be like and all that cool stuff so that being said links are in the description and let's do this all right so we're going to look at this image here obviously this is the one for world war ii zombies and we're going to try to look as closely as we possibly can there's not much we can like really see it's obviously faded it's an old sort of scrapbook picture but you can get a good idea of what this is going to look like um i'm pretty sure on the left I read somewhere that is like, obviously we're in Germany here, so the first map, you know, most likely is going to be in a German setting. Obviously, it's Nazi zombies, but think about it, like, I guess every map doesn't necessarily need to be in a Nazi realm in Germany in certain Nazi points, like, obviously, in this um, you know, what if scenario where what if the Nazis actually created zombies, you know, the zombies are basically going to end up being in different locations so it makes sense to start off in germany as you see here the left is like a the german word for like a bar or something or a beer I, I'm, I'm not exactly sure what it means but obviously it's a german word something along the lines of beer bar but it gives the location of it being in germany um so you start off in germany you start off at a nazi point a nazi held town where the zombies are really beginning to be spawned and created and you're fighting them and then you have to push back and then you end up at different locations like you know uh france england um different you know, maybe like uh, ukraine i don't know what's to, what's to the right uh poland poland that's poland right there um so different different things like that um but starting off in germany would make sense here again you see you have a pretty cool gate you have these different you have like a little clock tower there and it's basically just like a really cool old german town it's gonna be i i honestly think it's gonna be a really sick location and a really sick map and i think every location and every dlc map you know for this nazi zombies game mode it's gonna be the the ultimate the actual ultimate form of just true like gritty like scary nature and it's gonna be so freaking sick i don't know how to explain like we've said this before but this is like actually gonna be some crazy stuff and there it looks like they're actually doing something freaking insane you, nothing complete opposite of infinite warfare zombies and I want to get on with the video. I want you guys to, you know, I'm going to read you guys the storyline stuff with the letters. Um, and I'll go through probably, you know, different map location stuff in a second. And it's probably a different video. Um, but just looking at this image here, first map, most likely Germany. And then you move out to different locations around like Poland, France, and the UK and all that cool stuff. And obviously here, a nice little German town, Nazi point, a Nazi held point. It, it's going to be pretty sick. It's going to be pretty damn sick. So that being said, let's move on to the different letters and some pretty... I'm pretty sure vital storyline information for this new game mode. So, 
first letter here March 20th, 1941, right in the middle of World War II. Very interesting. And it says, Mein Lebling Marie. Okay, very interesting here. A lot of German stuff. Um, I hope this letter finds you well. How is life in England? I hope that your studies at Cambridge are going well. Father has always said that you are a natural scholar of our family, so I am sure adapting to... Okay, it says, I, I am sure adapting yo, your new life. I'm guessing it... I'm pretty sure it's not yo, your new life. Adapting to your new life uh, has been seamless. It's all good. Um... I have so much to tell you. Last time we spoke, I was angry, furious. Now that my anger was misdirected at you, I was frustrated that I, you know, had to leave my studies at um, Heidelberg, whatever, uh, to care for my father after my mentor, Professor uh, Linden, Linden, yeah, retired. I thought that there was no way we could ever play a role in Germany's scientific renaissance. Very interesting there. Maybe, maybe a bit of a hint. Germany's scientific renaissance. Maybe um, human experimentation. Maybe trying to bring people back from the dead? I don't know. I don't know. Could be. Um, but fate is a funny thing. If I had stayed at um, Heidelberg, I would have missed out on the greatest dis discovery of our time. Right un right underneath our noses. I wonder what that discovery is. Um, Marie, I wept when they found it. When the workers came in from the mine, talking about what they had found. This artifact of legend. My life has meaning again. My life has purpose. I had to get this message to where it mattered. To the Deutsches Reich. Okay? Interesting. My contacts at the university put me in touch with Fiora Heinz F. Rector. Okay. From there, it was only a matter of a couple days where the Anne Anne well, okay Anne -ne -re, okay something I don't know how to say that um rolled in with a full okay look, I'm gonna skim through this. You know why? Because I actually looked that up. Anne -ne -re, Anne -ne -re, Anne -ne -re. That's actually. There's a bunch of different things that I was looking up the other day, and I think I talked about it briefly in my, you know, Hitler in World War II video, where that sort of group is like this research group that Hitler sort of created, and he gave to a couple different officials, and he basically told them to go out and look for these new crazy things, and the Aninerbre, whatever, however you say that, they, they basically went for, you know, out, out of Hitler's orders, they went for this different stuff, including, you know, extreme human experimentation, and obviously in that realm, you know, trying to create zombies. So obviously, this is actually real, and I talked about in the video, how real are they going to make this? And I said, well, you know, you know, the Nazis tried to actually do stuff like this. They were interested. Hitler himself was known to be interested in these crazy mythical sort of things and rituals and stuff. And it looks like that Sledgehammer games, they're actually going forward with the stuff that actually happened, which I thought was going to happen, which is very cool. Obviously, you know, this is basically, this game is basically going to be like, what could have happened if the Nazis actually created zombies? And it's obviously very cool seeing this word I can't pronounce, but it's a real thing. You can, you can look it up, definitely. Maybe I'll show you guys an image of it somewhere. Um, but anyway, it goes through. It says, who would have imagined Marie? We're in the inner circle of personal tour. And she's basically getting hyped and stuff. Okay, so it's, it's pretty much done deal there. Now you have um, Marie's journal, okay? Very interesting. Now this is Marie from, I guess, you know, she's in England now, I'm pretty sure. Um, so she says, this is June 22nd, 1943. This is, what is this, two years later? Oh, wow. Damn. To, to, it took two years to send a letter? Okay, well, today has been difficult. Today has been difficult. Um, going through, um, she has evidence for him. Uh, while well, I'm grateful for the training I've received here, I fear I'll have to extend my reach beyond Prince William County. Um, a message from Kloss have grown more desperate. I hesitate to write this, but they begin on the border of madness. Um, my contact in the UK recommend I get in touch with a military artifact who is spearheading a new organization. Um, he called it the Monuments, Fine Arts, and Archives Program. Interesting name. Going through, blah, blah, blah. Uh, recovering and safeguarding historic and cultural uh, monuments, items that the Nazis have stolen from those valuable collections in Europe. Uh, uh, well, I can care less. Well, I can care less about the dusty artifacts. Claws. Okay, so the other I, I forgot to mention the the letter that we just read before is Claws from from Germany. I'm I'm pretty sure. And that and then they and um this person was there when they found all these crazy artifacts and you know zombies maybe who the hell knows maybe the, the element one one five who who knows what they found there but you know that's basically that. Um so 
there um so i can care less but they may provide the angle that i need um to get my operation moving in middleburg into my home down so after my exodus from baravia or bavaria <laughs> 10 years ago i never thought i would turn uh, going through some random stuff here claus has always been idealist always a patriot even those pillars blah, blah, going through brilliant minds top of his class uh, greatest physicist of our time, one of the ambitions, new voices leading, the, the Deutsche Psych. I don't know, I don't know, a lot of German stuff here. Um, now, for my years of training with the OSS, must come to service for one singular cause, to rescue my brother. So, is Claus Marie's brother? Interesting, interesting stuff here. Well, there's a bunch of different things here and then the reddit post says could marie be one of the main characters of this zombies mode i think that does make sense especially the fact that claws may turn out to be this guy obviously he is probably not going going to be fighting he seems pretty interested in sort of these crazy things the nazis have in in germany and all this insane stuff and it seems as if he's on that side and marie is probably going to be a, one of the main characters that we fight as and she is from england and i said in my other video you know that's basically what was going to happen obviously we're probably not going to have any germans play unless it's like a, a, a non-nazi or something but you know so this makes a lot of sense here um there, there are definitely some interesting parallels here um We'll have to really figure out what goes on here with Marine. How much like she knows about Claws and why is Claws, you know, writing to Marie and what's going on here? Um, obviously, they're brother and sister, but are they on the same page? Is one a Nazi? Is one not a Nazi? Is one just like really interested in artifacts and stuff? Because you know, Claws, he's, you know, like I said before. He's basically, I don't know if he's if he's a part of this team, um, but he says, you know, going back to the first letter that Claus wrote to Maria, or Marie, uh, my contacts at the university put me in touch, so he's in touch with the Fjord Heinz Rector, and then it's only a matter of days before the Anenerbe rolled in for um, the troops, and blah, 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 go through, okay, so, and then we have... Barbarossa's sword. That's probably something very interesting there. But basically what I'm saying is Claus, you know, has this apparent connection to this, you know, Nazi group. So it's going to be very interesting. I don't know if Marie is going to be fighting zombies and trying to save his brother from all the evil and who the hell knows, man. But now I just realized we've been talking about this for 10 minutes. So, mm. okay. So what I'm going to do is this is what I'm going to do. You're probably, okay. I'm going to cut I'm going to talk about the image, but you already heard me talk about the image, okay? Because I'm going to bring that to the beginning of the video. So, I guess I'll end it for you now, but I still need to record my analysis of the photo. Because I don't want to I don't want to analyze the photo right at the end, because everyone's going to leave. So, alright, so, I'll be back. Well, no, thank you guys for watching. I guess I'm, I have to, I'm ending the video. Thank you guys for watching. Um, and yeah, this is going to be really interesting here. So, that being said, yeah, I'll, I'll see you guys in a week. Well, I mean, I'll see you guys tomorrow, but I'll see you guys in a week. Most importantly for the World War II Zombies Reveal. Okay? Leave a like. If you're watching at the end of this video, leave a comment below Marie. Leave a comment below Marie. So I can see the accounts that are watching the whole video. Thank you guys for those those Hitler comments and all those all those on what was it? The M1911 comments. Those are the comments that you guys have been leaving if you've been watching the whole video. Again, really do appreciate that every time. And yeah, see you guys later.